Oh, bang, bang, let's go. We got a big haul. What's up, y'all? We got a huge haul today. Got about like a $150 haul here. Picked up, went value box hunting. You know how we like to do go value box hunting. So we're going to get into it. We got some WWE. We got uh, not some. We got a WWE. Um, a little bit of uh, soccer. Uh, for those in the other part of the world, football. We have some MLB. Some basketball, and we got some NFL. So we're going to get to it because this is a long haul. So the more I talk, let's get to it. We got the Bushwhackers, classic WWF. Here, had to pick up this bad boy, uh, Luke and Butch here. Rest in peace, Butch, who passed away a few days ago, about a week and a half ago. Uh, Butch here from the Bushwhackers. So, yeah, pretty dope. Had to add that to my WWE card collection. Miles will grab it now. Timing was right. Uh, we're going to get to our soccer. We got from top to Merlin. We have a Judy Bellingham. Green Refractor. With the Champions League. And then, as y'all know, I've been getting more into the soccer stuff. We got an Aurelian Tukamini from uh, Merlin. Europa. Europa. Rookie card. This is number two. Which one is this number two? 275. So, yeah, she's numbered the 275. So, that's pretty dope. Grab that bad boy. Um, We're going to go to our MLB. We got some MLB. I like to keep the cards down here. So, that way I'm not, like, spoiling the next card. When I've, I've noticed when I do it, I'm spoiling sometimes. Anyway, we got uh, Hots. I didn't even notice... These ones, y'all know I, I collect the uh, football and the basketball inserts uh, when, of the mosaic of these ones. But I didn't know where the hot sauce, these are the baseball version. So I, I, I guess I'll be collecting these. They look nice. They tight. Um, I guess I'll, I, I'll, 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 I may start collecting some of those ones. Um, I collect Bryce Harper stuff anyway. So I PC Bryce Harper. So I picked it up. Up next, we got a Shohei Otani. 2021 banner season AL MVP for my show Shohei PC. Everybody's picking up Shohei stuff since the World Baseball Classic. We got the big show. I thought this is dope because to me, this is three people in one card. You have Dan Patrick, uh, uh, Keith. Oh, what do you say? Is it o Oberman? Keith Oberman and uh, Cal Ripken Jr. So neat card, different card. A lot of the, all majority of this stuff is a dollar anyway, so it's not costing me much uh, to pick this stuff up and add it to the collection. Up uh, next, we got an A Rod League MVP refractor topped chrome. This year would have been which 2006, yeah, I think 2006 tops. So we add the A Rod in there. We got my man Randy Johnson. He was one of my favorite pitchers growing up. I PC Randy, so I had to add this in here. Stat stars on the game. Beautiful card. This is when he went to Diamondbacks, though. I like where uh, Randy was a Mariner. Um, we're gonna go with one Soto here. The Nationals refractor tops Chrome. Not a rookie card, but still a refractor. I PC Juan Soto, and we got some. Hard hitting Sammy Sosa. I like this. I like these cards. So I like. I pick up cards I like. Sammy Sosa. Nothing special. Not numbered. This is a nice card. And the same with the Chipper Jones. Nice card. Chipper was a badass. Then we got uh, Alec Baum. I've noticed a lot of people are sleeping on Alec Baum. Uh, Baum. How do you say this? Baum? Baum? Bomb, boom. They are, he already got a championship. So, uh, the future only looks bright for the brother. And, um, well, everyone's chasing Franco. I'll be going after Bomb, too. Bomb, I'm going to call him Alec Bomb, like Adam Bomb, like the wrestler. Adam Bomb, Alec Bomb. Uh, I picked up three of these because they were a dollar. See, that's what I'm saying. A dollar. A lot of people are spending a lot of the money to chase the same thing. Spend a dollar. I can sell a couple of these, make my money back, make a few bucks. We got a, a Jaron Duran refractor rookie card. Uh, another one that was a buck, two ninety nine. 
out of 299 there. You know there's a Red Sox fans out there. We got a Nico Horner, Refractor, uh, uh, Ben Baller, Topps Chrome. I, I just like the logo of those. Rookie card. Nico's another one that I feel like people are sleeping on. Nico's pretty good. Then we got a Mike Trout. Um, I think it's to do, do, do. I can't tell. I think it is to 99. I'm correct. Of course, the thing would be right over. Is it 99? No, it's to 199. So we got the Mike Trout. Mike Trout, the 199. Panini. Los Angeles. So it's not licensed, but still Mike Trout. Um, we're going to get on to basketball would be next. We'll do some basketball. We picked up some pretty neat basketball cards today and football too. So let's get into it. Y'all know I collect these splashed inserts. So I got a uh, D'Angelo Russell. We've been having a hard time finding the splashed and the other inserts that I collect recently. Uh, I thought it was cool card. Taco cool as hell. I mean, he's not NBA right now. Taco's in China. But you never know. Taco could be back. There's lots of taco fans. A taco disco for a buck. Purple disco at that. Why not, right? Um, We have a RJ Barrett silver rookie card. Um, Premium hoops. Not worth much, but for a buck. Why not an RJ Barrett? RJ could go off in the playoffs, have a run. Uh, same thing with Ob Toppin. I, I'm, I can't remember the name of these ones. What's the variation? It's bothering me. It, it's at the tip of my tongue, but it's it's glick slip. It's glimpse sh shimmer. The orange shimmer, right? Correct. If I'm correct, the Ob Toppin orange shimmer. Not numbered anything. And if you see like these cards are higher than a dollar, it, it was a dollar. They're they come from a bargain box bin, so. They're half off of the price that they're um, listed as. And up next, we got a Cam Thomas Silver. It's only a national pride, but for a buck, again, why not? And we got a Jalen Suggs Vortex at, uh, Revolution. Rookie. R fractal. That's right. These are fractals. Thought so. Just wanted to make sure. These are fractals. So I think Jalen Suggs. Is has a bright future. My this is my opinion. The guy can ball. Uh, Orlando's just we got another Jalen Suggs here. Revolution. Orlando's just a mess right now with a bunch of cluster. It's cluttered. They got all these young talent. But what to do with it? Including my man here, Franz Franz Wagner. They just got they got some talent, but they gonna have to figure something to put it put it together. We got uh the uh. I can't even think of the name. The, the I want to say screenshot. You guys know what the word. Uh, we got the K Cunningham prison rookie. Just having a hard time right now. I had a long day digging through boxes, so I'm a little tired. It took me like three hours digging through these boxes. You want to know what's crazy? This was a buck. I want y'all to take a buck. That's another pe person I keep finding in value uh, boxes that people are not. Maybe it's where I'm at locally. People are not uh, grabbing. So, Alpern, Alpern Seagoon, red, white, and blue for a buck. Oh, yeah, I'm grabbing that all day. And then we got my man Steph Curry, Shockwave, Fractal. Yep, for the long run. This is this is the stuff that you grab, stuff that later on that people go back and look for because they just thought it was an insert. Then they go back and go, oh, yeah, what about that Steph Curry, Fractal? So, uh, add that to the PC. We got a James Wiseman Shimmer rookie card. People's going back now, picking up Wiseman because Wiseman actually found his game in Detroit. So, yeah, Wiseman's becoming popular again. I picked up a uh, silver prism Wiseman here. Looks neat on all sides here. So I grabbed that Wiseman. Grabbing Wiseman while he's still cheap but hot. And we got some Desmond Bain, who's in the playoffs right now. Uh, uh, Red Wave Mosaic. I'm not sure y'all help me with this one. I'm not familiar with the uh, variation of this mosaic. So, yeah, this one isn't numbered. I wasn't sure if it was or not. And then we got the uh, 
the shimmer, um, orange shimmer of the uh, select. That would be not the, I'm thinking football right now. Courtside, right? Yeah, courtside prism. So this is a pretty neat card here to find. Find stuff like this in value boxes. I just, this is why I dig in value boxes. There's so much, in my opinion, gold just sitting in value boxes. All this stuff was sitting in value boxes. All this stuff, the Wiseman's, the, the, all this stuff. I didn't go through the showcase today at all because I just, there was so much stuff that was at the, in the, the boxes. So it was good to wait like uh, two weeks to go back to that store, come back and then them have some goodies. That's why I like going to that store. They always got some goodies in there. Um, up next, we're going to get to football here. Let's get through it. We got a Ray Lewis with the protector top finest Add that from our Ray Lewis package. We got a clear shots. Y'all know I like those inserts. It's just something about these inserts are cool. I was a Charles Woodson fan as a teenager, so I PC some Woodson. Don't mind having some cheap Woodson. That, that didn't sound right. Pause. Yo, we got a full throttle Jonathan Taylor. Elite. These are pretty cards. They're really pretty. I like them. Um, got my man, Micah Parsons, Youth Movement. I got to double check. I feel like I have this card. But I have to grab it anyway. That's my PC stuff. Same thing with Dak. Y'all know I PC my Cowboy stuff. So there's some Dak from my PC. I got another Dak Green Prism. I think this is this year's Prism. No, last year is 2021. Well, technically two years ago. Michael Carter. I noticed a lot of Zion in the uh, value boxes, and I just looked at them. I didn't think they were worth the value of getting. They're still up just a tad bit, but to see them now falling in value boxes show how quick things change for certain people, for some guys in this hobby. Like this guy. Here's another example. Y'all tell me what y'all think. For a buck, Zach Wilson, silver optic. What y'all? Is he done? Does he have a chance? Is it good to buy him now for a dollar or two nowadays? Because that's as cheap as his cards are. Think it's a smart option to pick him up or don't even think about him because he, he's done. He doesn't have a... He, Vince McMahon said he has no chance in hell. Y'all let me know in the comment section. I want a little bit of advice. Should I not waste a dime on him or should I pick him up as cheap as, you know? And then later on down the road, he could come and boom, Zach Wilson. Got a Marquez Stevenson, a silver rated rookie. Marquez Stevenson was a like a third or fourth kind of target there for Josh Allen for the Bills, a sleeper. So I'm sure there was a Bills fan that might want that. We got some Bailey Zappi rookie card, just a base, didn't cost me much, so I picked it up. Um, same thing with the Damian Pierce. That I guess that's a laser. I'm not I'm not familiar with the elite variations. Um, it's not numbered or anything, but it was a buck. Damian Pierce to me is a beast. I think y'all seen that last year. Bill check gotta get that boy some 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 freedom. Debo Samuel, hot routes. Cause this is the new inserts I've been collecting. I have the Justin Jefferson. And we have a Christian Watson rookie card. This one's numbered, if I'm correct. Nope. The Watson isn't numbered. So we got the what was that one numbered? Then I thought one of them were numbered. Debo numbered? Nope, Debo's not numbered. I thought one was. Maybe I was wrong. Uh this card here I'm gonna show next was a card that I couldn't believe that was in the dollar box for a buck. A buck. Just so you see it. A buck. A Devontae Adams Strata rookie card. Nothing's wrong with it. Corners, there's no surface problems. I just think it was something because the store guys like throwing jewels in those dollar boxes every now and then. And I think this was one of them. I don't know the value of it, but this is the Devonta Adams rookie card. A buck. Yeah, I had to pick that bad boy up. and was glad I was the one that found it. Um, up next... We got a Pat Garo. I like Pat Garo. I like the in with BC with uh, Boston College. I thought he ran hard. Don't know how well he'll do in the NFL, 
for a cheap card. I think it costs what a card? A buck? Right. A buck, one ninety nine. Bowman first. Yeah, I'll go with that. I will go with, what, what would this be? A blue lava? I think that's it. I think that's what they call their refractors in uh, Bowman. The lavas. These are the lavas. Help me if I'm wrong. Then up next, we got a number card of 350. Matt Ryan. This would have been his second year card here. This Matt Ryan. Um, yeah. So I grabbed that. Second year Matt Ryan numbered. Sure, there's a Matt Ryan fan looking at that. Maybe I'll add it to my uh, Matt Ryan package. I think I, I think I still have the package. I don't know if it's sold or not. What I well, what happens with some players, what I'll buy... Or when I open up cards, I'll add them to like the player bundles. Then sell the player bundles because some people collect just the players. So some people will buy like a Pascal Siakam bundle or or, or uh, Fred Van Vliet, whatever the player may be. But they're getting a ton of cards or a few cards of that player for a cheap price. So stuff like that, I'll add um, if it doesn't sell as a single just into those packages. We got a uh, Earl Campbell. 299 this is 99 out of 299s it's a scorecard but i mean come on it's a purple earl campbell man that's a purple earl campbell and it was only a two dollar card so i'm not gonna cry for that and up next we got a number dj moore uh laser i don't know again not familiar with elite i love love the look of the cards obviously i picked them up you obviously see me pick them up um number the 125 dj moore so i had to grab that DJs could have a hot year with Justin Fields. Y'all know I've been picking up my Justin Fields stuff like crazy. I still can't believe I got that dual patch National Treasures Justin Fields for four dollars. I don't even think it was four. It was two dollars. I think the card is worth like ninety bucks. But that's why I keep digging in these boxes. You just never know. The card that I showed y'all in the last video. Go look at the video I uploaded before this. It was a uh, Stefan Diggs uh orange prism i bought the car for a few bucks i sold it for like 45 50 bucks and that just came out of the value box so there's profit on stuff like that the same with the rg3 from the video that was both cards sold the same night so i made my money back immediately off that whole value box hunt just selling those two cards so the rest of those cards from that last video i still have all free or profit uh, but let's get back to the video here. We got a Velas Jones rookie card here. Bad boy. That's number 275, Velas Jones. The shorts. There we go. Velas Jones from the Tennessee Vols to the Bears. He's a, he's a bad boy. That's like Justin Fields got he got he got he got some. He does actually got some weapons. And who's gone? Montgomery's gone, so they got Khalil. Khalil is it Khalil? Can't think of his name. Khalil, whatever his name. Um, and then next, we got Aaron Donald, number two. I want to say this Aaron Donald was numbered to 99. I feel like his number, to, I'm not, I don't feel like going through pulling it out and all that. But $2 Aaron Donald, number to 99. Pick it up any day. Hall of Famer, soon to be. Then we got a new generations 22 certified Hassan Hopkins, Hopkins, Haskins to uh, 349. Pick this bad boy up, patch, rookie card, and I uh, picked up the matching color, not matching color, but the same card, just different color, the 199. Put those on the screen. So you got this one, then you have that patch. Probably get rid of these in some sort of deal, two, two patches, decent deal. Tennessee fan, Haskins fan out there. Haskins was a Michigan State, correct? No, no it was Michigan. It was Mich the Wolverines, yeah. So, uh, Haskins. Then up next, we're down to the last three here. We got uh, rated rookie Jamar Chase. It's a pretty bad boy. That's a bad car, man. I like those clearly dominant rated rookies. They're nice. We got a Justin Fields to back him up next, which is crazy because this... They all, this, this pose is all the same, but I'll take him. My Justin Fields, I'm off to my, I think Justin Fields is going to have a big year. And the next and last, we have a certified stars, Justin Herbert card. Uh, I want to say it's to 99. Yeah, it's to 99. So we got the Justin Herbert to 99 red. Yeah. 
nice, nice little run here today. Some numbered, some rookies, some colored, some variations, lots of football, basketball, some soccer, baseball. So I'm I'm happy in a huge haul like this. Huge haul. This is why I like going hunting. I hate when I go to the stores and can only find a couple things. It's nice to go into the store. I can come out with a huge stack, make some, save some, put some away, add some to the PC. That's what us sports collector hobbyists like uh, guys like doing. For the guys who like making money, the guys who just like collecting, shout out to all y'all out there. It ain't a war. Uh, there's enough out there for all of us. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Y'all do me a favor. If you watch this whole video, smash the like button. Give it a share for me. And if you're new, please subscribe. I will catch you guys next time. Until then, y'all have a good one. Peace.